hey hi guys so welcome to uh, do it easy guide videos so today i'm gonna discuss with you uh, about uh, uh, dreams time uh, stock video uploading and uh, how to export a correct uh, video format with correct uh, codecs so uh, as a uh, dreams time uh, they required uh, now if you go to this URL you see here their technical requirement is the video format should be quick time MOV format and very important compress with photo JPG codex or motion JPEG codec photo JPEG or motion JPEG okay. so uh, and the quality set between 70 to 90 percent okay and max length will be 30 seconds so uh, now here I'm gonna talk with you uh, how to uh, export a video with correct uh, format and uh, maybe uh, this will be important for other stock uh, site as well now if you're using Photolia or uh, iStock or Shutterstock uh, uh, probably uh, this will be a same method and so let me show it to you so here I have uh, some uh, uh, video file which is uh, rendered as an image sequence and I am gonna use Adobe After Effect for my video exporting okay so I'm gonna open Adobe After Effect and uh, here I already have uh, imported my image sequence and uh, created them as uh, final uh, sequence now if you see here now this one this uh, girl running video and at the end I have uh, created this uh, uh, white mask uh, so now if you wonder how to do it let me quickly show you now uh, once you open after effect you just go to file import files or you can uh, just double click on this project area and locate the file folder and if you have an image sequence you just need to select first image and tick on this PNG sequence file this tick put a tick mark on this and open now if you have a single video file again you can select the video file from here and open so in the, my, my case I'm gonna select this first image and put a tick mark here and click open okay now see now this is the uh, the video footage if you double click you can see it okay so uh, the the uh, the then uh, you can just drag and drop it to this icon to create a new composition okay see now this is a, this is a new composition that's been created and uh, the after effect automatically put the footage file there and uh, see this is the video file so on my case i am going to need a background image uh, i am going to need a background so i am going to right click and create a solid and i am going to select a white solid and then i am going to put it behind of this video footage and that's it I'm simply ready to uh, export this video and actually uh, you may can uh, uh, increase levels of this video file and uh, actually I can do another thing I'm gonna take a duplicate of this uh, layer and make a soft light and uh, reduce the opacity I'm just uh, increasing the color 
uh, see the difference okay so okay so uh, now we are ready to export now this video is uh, 12 second uh, long so the shutter stock say sorry a dreams time says the max uh, duration is 30 seconds so we are fine on it so uh, so let me show you how to export now uh, actually I'm gonna close this one and I'm I'm gonna use my, my original composition which is uh, with this uh, uh, mask okay so now assume you are uh, done with uh, uh, finalizing the clip on the composition then uh, I'm gonna save it then uh, you need to select this uh, magnification up to 100% and then check the quality is full and then go to composition add to render queue okay then the render queue panel is opening and then here you should click on this lossless you see this lossless yellow text click on it and then here the format dreams time says it should be quick time mov so format quick time okay and then they saying codec should be photo jpeg or motion jpeg so let's select that now once you select this format here quick time then go to this format option and from here you should select photo jpeg actually i have already selected otherwise you just go click on here this drop down and select photo jpg or motion jpeg a actually i'm going to use photo jpeg not jpeg 2000 but photo jpeg and this is the quality that they were mentioned here uh, up to 70 to up to 90 percent okay so you can uh, set this quality if you need you can make it 90 actually I'm gonna uh, just uh, select 100 percent and uh, press ok and then here should be RGB and million of colors and this is fine and we don't have an audio here on this clip so that's we are fine and then uh, you can click on this best setting and check on this quality should be best and resolution full and these are fine and then here you can select the output video location so you can click on it and select the final folder and uh, give the file name and then click save and then you need to click render then it will begin rendering and then it will create a final mov file you see the render is going on so i'm gonna pause my video and we'll come back once it finish okay so it's uh, almost done all right here we go so then uh, we can uh, check the video file so this is a video file you can see the file size is uh, 92 MB which is fine and frame size is full HD length is 23 second and uh, uh, yeah she is running okay so uh, that's uh, basically how you can uh, export a video file as it uh, matches the technical requirement for uh, dreams time video footage or shutterstock of Photolia actually Photolia I know uh, that the, they are accepting M mp4 file uh, and some other formats but uh, the important thing is uh, now 
when when you're using a photo jpeg as a codec uh, means uh, you can uh, preserve almost uh, the original video quality but if you use uh, mp4 uh, h264 uh, H codec then uh, probably will end up losing some quality information uh, and actually they have they have uh, describing it here uh, if you check this page now the photo jpeg mean the compression method is intra frame and uh, this mp4 h264 format means they are using inter frames means uh, compression is bit uh, quality uh, less compression method so it's always good to give you something better to your customers so I prefer to use uh, this uh, MOV uh, photo MOV uh, photo JPEG codec so uh, thank you very much for watching and uh, actually let me show you another thing uh, yeah uh, I'm using uh, no that's fine I actually uh, I think uh, I'll uh, uh, show you from another video uh, how to uh, export uh, video sorry upload video using a uh, FTP server to your uh, Shutterstock or Dreamstime or Fotolia to, to your account okay so uh, let's uh, meet another video thank you for watching this and uh, goodbye